Welcome, Sagittarius. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for December 31st, 2023, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. Greetings, dear Sagittarius. In this special reading for you today, we will explore the energies surrounding your life right now. The astrologer mentioned that she will focus on revealing possible obstacles to attracting abundance in your life. She has highlighted the presence of an energy that can be linked to possession, addiction, and possessive behaviors. This could indicate an excessive connection to desired outcomes, suggesting a disconnection from your higher self. The Nurturing Temple card points out the possibility that emotions stored in your being are generating distractions in your focus. The analogy of a cleanser is presented, proposing to simplify your food choices and your relationships to reconnect with yourself. It emphasizes the importance of reconnecting with your higher self and collaborating with it to experience a sense of freedom. A reminder is presented that you possess two parts, your physical self and your higher self. The key is to reconnect with the source to be guided towards abundance. A natural transformation process is mentioned that is taking place, also affecting your energy body. The need to address the toxins stored in your body and shift focus from lack to abundance is emphatically underlined. The Capricorn Sun and Jupiter share a sweet exchange this morning, dear Sagittarius, reminding you that prosperity cannot be rushed. Make the most of this cosmic climate by seeing the value in moving slowly and appreciating the journey that will take you where you want to be. You'll need to back up your words with decisive action later today when Mercury retrograde crosses over Mars, especially when it comes to ideas shared or promises made in the past. Look for opportunities to get organized by cutting the unnecessary from your life this evening when Luna and Uranus align in our skies. You are feeling very adventurous and are determined to make your own way today. You are going to conquer all obstacles in your path by sheer determination and the force of your will. Nothing is going to hamper your progress today. So, you can schedule all your difficult activities today and you will find success in them coming quickly and without hassle. The horizon is clouded with doubt. You're feeling the frustrations brought about by recent decisions about your love life. In other words, you're getting cold feet. Today you must draw on your willpower and self-control in order to face your problems realistically while vanquishing your anxieties. You might consider visualizing your next move before making it today due to a Mars-Neptune square that requires some reorientation, dear Sagittarius. Options can be uncertain, or something slash someone is draining you, and you need to take a step back to catch your breath and reimagine your plans. While there can be confusion and exaggeration to this energy, slowing down and taking a break from overthinking benefit you. As the day advances, a Venus-Pluto influence helps you prioritize. Your passions and interests come into strong focus. New insight into financial or security concerns can also emerge. Desires are especially intense as you tend to keep them to yourself, so finding ways to release them, even in small ways, can work to your advantage. There is also good energy for recycling or repurposing resources to transform them, and it can be satisfying to make the most of what you have. As an angelic message, the importance of rewarding yourself is highlighted. After a period of giving a lot, it is time to receive. The balance between giving and receiving is considered essential to keep your energy and motivation levels high. May these reflections shine on your day, Sagittarius. Remember that connecting with your higher self and seeking abundance begins from within. Until the next reading. Today's tarot reading for your sign. Card of the day, the Empress, inverted. The Empress, inverted, suggests that today you may feel some emotional disconnection or lack of harmony in your relationships. It may be that you find yourself more focused on superficial aspects or that, for some reason, you are resisting expressing your true feelings. 
It is essential to remember the importance of authenticity and open communication in your interactions. Financial Aspect, Ten of Pentacles In the financial sphere, the energy of the Ten of Pentacles highlights the importance of stability and taking care of the home. It may be a good time to pay attention to your family and financial matters. Are there any decisions related to family or inheritance that require your attention? You may find yourself more focused on domestic matters and ensuring the safety and prosperity of your home. Relationships, Five of Wands In the area of relationships, the Five of Wands indicates possible conflicts or disputes. There could be challenges in communicating with someone close to you, and it is crucial to handle any disagreements with patience and understanding. Avoid falling into unnecessary confrontations and seek peaceful solutions to resolve conflicts. Tarot Advice, The Fool The Fool suggests that keeping an open mind and being willing to take bold steps could be beneficial today. Although you may face challenges or unexpected changes, embracing adventure and spontaneity can lead to new opportunities. Don't be afraid to leave your comfort zone and explore new possibilities. Today, Sagittarius, focus on authenticity in your relationships and stability in your financial affairs. Pay attention to emotional cues and avoid unnecessary conflicts. Keep an open mind and be prepared to adapt to the day's surprises. Honesty and flexibility will be your allies on the path to balance and growth. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. Talking about your work with your family might be overly stressful, Sagittarius. You might become agitated trying to explain your career path when Mercury retrograde in your sign conjuncts Mars in your sign and squares Neptune in Pisces. Loved ones may not inherently understand why you do what you do for a living. Talking it over time and time again can be frustrating, especially if you feel like you are just going in circles. Instead of repeating the cycle, Use today's cosmic energy to refocus the conversation towards something else that everyone can agree on. Under this lunar energy, there's a lot to be thinking of at this time and it's time to acknowledge where an inner narrative in your head may be holding you back from your financial goals. It's also a day of positive manifestation for you and your ability to manifest at this time to attract what it is you need is powerful today. Be sure to recharge your batteries also. This is a great time to reconnect with yourself. Where do you feel you lack a sense of motivation in your life? This lunar energy encourages you to find it and grasp it. Embrace the change that is coming as this is a powerful time for change. The tarot gives you your lucky number. Your lucky numbers for December 31st are 30, 11, 47, 20, 51, 29. Daily Love While there's certainly been turbulent cosmic weather this month, today could have you singing a different tune, Sagittarius. This is because the glorious Sun, our radiant luminary, will dance joyously with mighty Jupiter, your planetary ruler. Everyone's spirits will be exceptionally high, encouraging everyone to socialize, circulate, and strut their stuff. This would be a phenomenal day to do something extra special. So, plan a major vacation next year, act like kids again, or simply just give the object of your desire a locket with your photos in it. This could bring so much magic to your heart. Is it easy for you to experience intimacy with your romantic partner? What are the things that scare you the most in your partnership that may be preventing you from experiencing as much closeness and depth with your lover? Ask yourself these important questions today as the moon is in Cancer and in your 8th house. True intimacy is being able to share those darker or less happy parts of yourself with your significant other. Unfortunately, this is something we are not conditioned to do, we are told directly or indirectly by society that there are parts of ourselves that are best not to be shared with others, because otherwise they will leave us or judge us. Therefore. This is a great time for you to practice bringing more of that dialogue between you and your partner, 
making sure that both of you feel safe and trust one another to bring those aspects of yourselves into the partnership. At work. The day is best suited for speculative ventures. Buy a lottery ticket or invest in stocks and share today and you have a high chance of hitting the jackpot. You may also get a good tip from someone and if you act timely on it, you can significantly increase your income. You will enjoy a calm and peaceful day at work. What is the current nature and condition of your joint financial partnerships and investments? The moon is in Cancer today and in your 8th house, and it is asking you to reflect just on that. Do your investments give you back as much as you put into them? That is what determines whether it is an area of your life that deserves your energy and attention or not. Do not waste your time pouring your soul into something that will not provide you with a fair and just reward. Make sure that those whom you're in financial partnership are coming from the same place as you and seeking the same outcomes. Both parties have to be willing to give as much as they expect to take or receive. Health. You are a sensitive individual and so is your digestive system. As soon as you consume something which is not in accord with your digestive system, your body will reject it. You may suffer from loose motions or vomiting and the condition will get severe if not checked. Try to go for indigenously prepared medicines. This full moon transit is a great time for Sagittarius to focus on personal growth and exploration. Take time to connect with nature or try a new activity. To balance the energy, practice self-care activities like journaling or taking a relaxing bath. Amethyst or Labradorite can be helpful crystals for Sagittarius, promoting spiritual growth and intuition. Family and Friends Your partner is cooperative and supportive. Go share your concerns with your dear ones rather than keeping the worries within you. That will be of great help and will relieve your stress to quite an extent. Try it over a coffee if it is linked to your partner indeed, they won't react much in public so you can easily blurt it out. You tend to put up a pretty cool front most of the time. There are a lot of reasons for this, personal reasons I'm sure, but one is that you simply don't always want people to see all the effort and passion and energy that is actually required to pull off the impressive feats you manage on a regular basis. Well, while I totally appreciate managing to come off as chill and unflustered no matter what, the universe is coming together to remind you that sometimes you don't need to be chill and cool and perfect for people to like you. In fact, if you were open about your passions and desires they might even like you a whole lot more than you could have ever hoped. Compatibility At work Pisces In love Taurus In luck Aries Your lucky color today Cain. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.